Hello video editors, welcome to Sali Tutorials. In this video, I'll show you how to create an advanced masking effect in Filmora 14. We'll be using AI tools, masking and animation to make this effect look professional and unique. So let's get started. So, to create this advanced masking effect in Filmora 14, I already have a video in the media. I drag and drop it onto the timeline. In the preview you can see two girls sitting on the beach looking at the sea. Now I duplicate this video on the timeline and disable the one below. I double click on the duplicated video. In the video panel, I go to the AI matting section and turn on the AI portrait cutout tool. From the model settings, I choose the advanced cutout mode and wait until the background is removed. As you can see the background around both girls is now gone. Next I make another duplicate of this video. I hide the second track, then double click on the new duplicate. I turn off the AI portrait cutout tool and go to the mask section. Here I select the linear mask. Rotate it to about 90 degrees. And place it on the edge of the seawater in the video. Now I add a transform keyframe to this mask, and wherever adjustments are needed, I animate the rotation and position with keyframes, like this. After animating the mask I go to the media tab and import a textured stone wall PNG image and a background video from my computer. The free download link for both files is in the description. I drag and drop the PNG image to the track above the timeline, then double click on it. In the basic section, I adjust the Y position so the image sits right on the edge of the seawater. I also animate the position of this stone wall PNG so it moves naturally with the video. Once that's done, I scroll down the tracks, delete the lowest video, and replace it with the new background video I just imported. I drag and drop it into place, then trim or speed it up to match the length. Now the new background is visible inside the masked area. Finally, I enable all the tracks and move the second track, the one with the AI portrait cutout, to the very top. I delete any empty tracks, and the advanced masking effect is complete. Let me know in the comments what you think, and what name we should give this effect. More awesome tutorials are on the way, so stick around with Sally Tutorials.